What's up guys? In this video, I'll be showcasing my open source trading bot I've been working on that I finally finished using the help of ChatGPT. The bot's basis uses concepts of arbitraging mempools and front-run leveraging popular decentralized exchanges like Uniswap. Put simply, the bot operates on sandwiching transactions. It analyzes the waiting room for transactions that have been initiated but not yet processed. After reading this waiting room, which is usually referred to as the mempool, it picks certain transactions to specify higher gas fees than the initiated fees, allowing us to process our transaction first, then process a sell order right after. Meaning the pending transactions get sandwiched by ours, giving us the profit and the slippage. If this sounds complicated, it's really not. I've been using this bot, fine tuning and earning passive income for months. You don't need any coding experience whatsoever since the code was pretty much entirely generated by artificial intelligence. Let's go to my computer and get started. First, make sure you have the MetaMask browser extension installed. You'll need a Web3 wallet like MetaMask to interact with Remix. There's many different Web3 wallets you can use other than MetaMask. They will all work with Remix. MetaMask is the easiest and safest to use in my opinion. Now, we'll go to Remix. Remix is used for creating Solidity-based smart contracts. I'll put a link to Remix along with everything else you need in the description below. It may take some time for Remix to load. Patiently wait while everything loads in. Now, on the sidebar on the left, create a new contract under the Contracts folder. Name it bot.soul. In the description, I've linked the bot's source code. This is an open source. Feel free to verify the code yourself if you'd like. Copy the code and paste it into the file bot.soul you've just created. This is our bot. Everything is already set by default. Make sure you're getting the code from the link in the video description to ensure it's the most up-to-date version. Before we compile our bot, make sure to read the quick user guide at the top. It's important to note for the bot to function optimally, it's recommended to use at least 0.5 Ethereum or more. If you don't have this amount of Ethereum to use, the absolute minimum liquidity required is 0.2 Ethereum. Anything less than 0.2 Ethereum runs the risk of absolute losses. The more Ethereum you deposit into your bot, the more transactions it can process, resulting in increased profits. For demonstration purposes, I'll be using one Ethereum. Normally, I'll run my bots with higher amounts of Ethereum. Like I said before, the more Ethereum the bot has to work with, the more profitable the bot can be. Let's go over to the Solidity Compiler tab now. On the very top of the code, you'll see it's built with the 0.8.4 version of Solidity. Under Compiler, select the 0.8.4 version so it matches our bot. Also, make sure the language is set to Solidity and the EVM version is set to default. Click on CompileBot.Soul and wait for the bot to compile. Now, let's deploy this from our wallet. Head over to the Deploy and Run Transactions tab. Here, select Injected Provider as the environment. MetaMask will pop up, just connect it. Everything looks good. Click Deploy. I always set gas fees to aggressive. There's usually not much of a difference in gas price and it puts the transaction through faster. Let's wait for the transaction to confirm. Sweet, we can see here that it's confirmed, meaning our smart contract is deployed. Scroll down and click this. Now, you can see your bot's control panel. These two are for more advanced users. Don't touch them unless you've used bots like this before. Start native will start the bot, enabling it to read mempools. Stop will stop the bot, exiting mempools. Withdraw will withdraw the entire bot's balance back to your wallet. Debug can be useful if you run into issues. Let's copy our smart contract address with this button here and paste it into Etherscan to make sure it's created. Yep, it was created successfully. Next, let's fund the contract. I'll copy our smart contract address once more and head over to MetaMask. MetaMask. 
Make sure you've got your bot's address in there. Let's put in one Ethereum and set gas fees to aggressive once again. Nice. Transaction confirmed. Now our bot has Ethereum to work with. Let's double check our contract on Etherscan to make sure it's funded. Perfect. Now, the last step is to click Start Native. Let's set the gas fee to aggressive again and click Confirm. I'm going to let the bot run for a full day and review our results. Alright, it's been a little over a day. I stopped the bot but haven't checked the profits yet. Let's refresh Etherscan and see what we're at. It's over 2.5 Ethereum. That's 1.5 Ether gained in 24 hours. Now, let's retrieve our bot's balance. Since the bot is already stopped, we can now click the withdraw button. You'll need to click the stop button before doing this, but I already did it. I'll set it to aggressive again and click confirm. There we go. Transaction confirmed. Let's check our MetaMask. Nice. As you can see, the bot's balance is in my wallet. Keep in mind, this is after only 24 hours. The profits will fluctuate day to day depending on available liquidity. Let me know what profits you get in the comments below. I've been working on this for a long time and could have easily charged money for it. All I'm asking is if you could like and share the video and also subscribe to my channel. Anyways, seriously give this a try. I'll see you guys in the next one.